Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Bob and in my channel I talk about how to make money and once you make it, how to invest it. And today I want to talk about one of the most sought after topics, which is passive income. And I actually want to talk about the truth about passive income because there's a lot of misinformation if you ask me, or a lot of things that people actually leave out in their videos when it comes to how to make you know, passive income a thousand a month or even you know the craziest amounts that you can actually see on certain YouTube videos. So there's three or four sort of lies or things people don't tell you that I want to go over. And the first one is that passive income isn't a get rich quick scheme. Right? It's not something that you start right now and you will get rich super fast. You could just start reinvesting and start buying real estate. But some people say it is actually something that will take a lot of time. Now think about the ways that people tell you to make passive income. It could be that you create a YouTube channel and people start watching your videos. And you make money off of AdSense. Now I've made quite some videos. I, you know, I'm not even monetized as a channel yet. And it's a lot of work and sure once it's out there, and once your channel is big and you get like two, three, four hundred thousand views on every video, you can make a lot of money. And, you know, but it's it's not like that is something that will just happen overnight or buy real estate and you will start getting money out of that. Cool. But how do you get the money to get real estate? So passive income is there's a reason why it's so popular. And I think it is super important to look at, especially if you think about your retirement later on. But it is not something that will happen overnight. And it's something you have to remember. It will take time. It will take energy. There will you know, be moments that you think, oh, this is not going to work or why am I not making any money? So you really have to push through and passive income, as nice as it sounds, it is not a get rich quick scheme. And that also brings me to my second point here, which is we don't learn this in school. We don't learn about passive income in school. And why is that important in this video? Well, because the way to learn this, the, the places to learn about passive income is here on YouTube, is on you know maybe reading books or, or those things. And the most important thing that you have to check when you are trying to learn about passive income, how to generate it, is who is teaching me this? Why should I listen to them? And very often at the end of a video on passive income where they will tell you it's super easy, they will pitch you a product, they will pitch you a course, they will pitch you coaching, there will be affiliate links under there. And sure, you know, why not? It's there, it's your right to pitch something. But are they saying all these things about passive income because they actually want to help you and actually feel like it's, you know, there's a lot of value in here? Or are they just trying to give you this little tip of the iceberg and then make you pay them? in order to actually get all the value. So do your research. Do people actually generate passive income or do people actually even have, you know, some kind of a background in finance or anything? And are they, you know, what are they selling me afterwards? Full disclosure, I don't sell anything. There's no affiliate links. There's no coaching. There's no course. I actually do this because I think it's super, super important. I struggled a lot with starting to generate passive income. I recently bought my first holiday rental. I have some passive income coming out of software, other things and some some other things. But I really had to struggle and, and get there. And I would love to pass on that information. All I ask for in return is if you think it's of value, hit that little like button, the bell, subscribe if you haven't already. That helps me out a lot and hopefully I can help out other people. So going back into the video. So the third thing is passive income isn't passive. And that is kind of weird if you if you think about it. Passive income, as I said, it, it takes time to, to get it. But even when you get passive income, it's not like you don't have to do anything to nurture it. As an example, I used to get quite a nice amount every single month out of ClickFunnels. ClickFunnels is a software and they have an affiliate system. You get 40% of whatever someone uh, pays to ClickFunnels um, if you refer them. And over time, that will diminish because I stopped promoting my link. I stopped promoting basically click funnels for them. So that means that if you don't nurture it, the revenue will actually start going down. And the same goes with, you know, if you think that buying a rental property from that moment on, it's just free cash coming in. Think again, you know, there's maintenance, you, you know, maybe you have to find new tenants, tenants have problems and sure you can outsource this and you can hire someone for this, but there's always these things that you have to do, pay the taxes. It is not passive and you have to keep working on it. Last example, YouTube. Again, people say that once you have a big following, people will keep watching old videos, you will keep making money. And yes, you know, that's true. 
But think about what Google wants, what YouTube wants. YouTube wants you to keep creating content, to keep getting people on their platform because that's how they make money. So if you just disappear and stop making videos, your AdSense will go down. The views and the way that YouTube pushes you will go down. So you have to keep putting out content. So passive income, it is great, but it's hard work. Um, you have to check who's teaching it to you. And then the last thing is that it is not really passive. Now, the fourth and final thing that I would like to talk about uh, when it comes to, uh, to passive income is that it shouldn't be your only income source. Passive income is cool, but there can, things can happen. The real estate market can change. You know, maybe a lot of people get unemployed. Maybe YouTube demonetizes your channel or something happens, which actually happened in the past that a lot of people stopped promoting or stopped paying for ads on certain channels. Maybe the software that you're using uh, stops paying out commission. Maybe you are into dividend stocks and something like what happened this year happens and a lot of companies stop paying dividends. So yes, generate more and more passive income. That is a very good way to, you know, to reinvest and to really create and increase your wealth, but also have other income streams. When you ask me, actually working and doing things to get your money as well is it's satisfying and you learn. And what I learned from being an entrepreneur and running businesses is something that I can then turn into value here. And then maybe someday this channel will be monetized and it will you know, result into some passive income, but it should not be your only source of income. Now, don't get me wrong. Passive income is great. You know, it's very valuable. It is something that will, you know, really, really be beneficial to you but it's not as easy as what a lot of these people make it seem. And it is hard work and you know you should know this before trying it because otherwise you might start, you get demotivated and you stop. And that is just a waste of your time, energy and of a good opportunity because again, you know, creating passive income is something that I think everyone should be doing. But keep in mind these four things that people often don't tell you. So I hope this was of a lot of value to you. I hope that this will help you to at least keep pushing through when you start doing passive income. I'll bring out a video soon where I think, you know, here are some things that you can actually make passive income with. And if it was of value, you haven't done so already, like, subscribe, all those things. It helps out the channel. It helps me out as well. And hopefully it will help out a lot of other people. And I will see you in the next video.